Phantom Jax here coming at you with another video. Today I'm gonna show you my breath. Today I'm gonna show you how I do my makeup if I'm just going to work, but I'm not I'm going to work. If I do my makeup I'm going to work, it normally means I'm going out after. But today I'm not. Today I just want to film a video. So I'm gonna do a kind of brown nude smoky eye kind of look today. Uh, I first start off, I'm just going to jump straight in, okay, because that's just, I feel like the only way I can do this. I'm just going to show you what I do, in case you're having trouble with how you do your makeup. But let your struggles come to an end, my dear. Eyebrows. I like to brush them out. I use this. The lids broke off and I don't remember what it's called. Sorry. I use the darkest shade because I've got dark eyebrows and uh, I don't like to um, like properly make it look like that I've got some twigs on my face. I just fill in the parts that I feel that need filling in. So obviously, hang on there's a car, uh, but I put in the product as I'm doing now. And then I just brush it out again. So can you tell I've done an eyebrow? Can you tell? Um, right, so I really try to use as little product as possible. I haven't put much up at this end, but a fair bit down here. Um, less product is more. That's what my mother told me. Also run out of concealer, so um, from underneath my eyebrows. I just use a light foundation, probably not the best idea but you know. So I'm using L'Oreal Paris Lumi Mag EQ Light Infusing Foundation. Flawless skin as if lit from within. Here you go, this is what it looks like, it's not going to focus because I don't know how to use my camera, but oh well. Um, okay, so I pump a little bit of it onto my main... <laughs> It's a foundation brush because my other brush has gone missing. Yay! So it's on my brush. Put it on each eye. Just because you don't want to use too much. And you can end up using a, more on one eye and not enough on the other. So I'm literally just underlining my brow for more definition of you've heard. Uh, yeah. So, underlining that brow. really just gives it that, um, you know, hey, these are my eyebrows, look at them, kind of thing. Just get that in all the nooks and crannies if you can. Yeah, see, now that I've got the concealer on, the foundation, the light foundation, I feel like my eyebrows don't look as dumb. <laughs> okay. Eyebrows, concealer. I'm not doing a cut crease today, I'm just gonna do um, some nude brownie colours. I always use my Moa palette, Makeup Academy Professional. Um, even if I'm not base, I'm not using this as a base colour, I always use it because I love the highlight shade and I love this purple colour this one it's called Adore <laughs> I adore it so I'm using um, the collection palette the Eyes Uncovered Nudes Nude Bronze palette I really like this palette I've done my makeup before with it Cherub um, I put it under my eyebrow because this is a really 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 nice one for that from the collection palette and uh, I don't put it all over the eye because uh, I see most people they, they they put the light shade on all over. I just do it here, this front bit, 
uh, this is where I struggle. I genuinely, I just have to guess, but that's how life works. Okay, I reckon that's fine. Right, and then I take the mink shade, second shade in, this one. Um, three strokes or something like that, maybe one more. And then I, um, I like to hold my eye and then I... I blend out of the crease and uh, speaking to some girls at work and uh, they're like, how do you do your makeup then? Don't get it, I just don't get it. Um, just blend, seriously. Blend for as long as you possibly can. I leave like an hour and a half to do my makeup when I go out and it takes me probably 45 minutes just to do my eye makeup, but this is always gonna be cut down. But uh, So I'm putting in the crease a little bit like that, and then I put this on this side because I like I don't like to use much product. Because um, one, the product lasts longer, and two, you don't look all caked. You know what I mean? I'm sorry if half this video isn't in focus. It's just because I don't have to use my camera yet. Um, so is that the yet? And it is about the brush you use. I really don't like the sponges for your eyes. They they just they just put too much on. But this brush is, I don't know, oh, shadow. <laughs> so just blend, blend it. You just want to blend for as long as you possibly can. I'll get up and use the mirror, so I'm using the And you feel your crease, you know where your crease is, it's here. That's your crease, where your eye bends, that's, bends? Where your eye closes, that's your crease. Blend it out, blend it out, blend it nice and out. <laughs> and then I use Ember, the shade Ember, which is second from the back. It's um, not the darkest shade, but it's not the lightest shade. And then I do the same thing, kind of, but less less in the crease. So I dab it here, like that. Put the product on. Put the product on this side. And then I'm just going to blend it out again. But I'm not, I'm only going in the crease. I'm not going on my whole eyelid. Um, so don't get carried away. Otherwise, you will look silly. That that was me going on my eyelash line. Okay, so it's just so for so long, I've been wanting to film a makeup video, but I just haven't seemed to be able to find the right lighting. This lighting is great. <laughs> Wait, when when I put my hand down here, I'm just I'm just doing that to just try and get rid of product because I don't like a lot of product. So far, so good. So many shades is that? Three. Can you believe it? Um, literally, just keep blending. Just blend, 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 blend. If you if you think your makeup, like if you think you've blended enough, blend some more. Just blend some more. So I just then I thought that I blended enough. But I'm just gonna blend a little bit more, just in case, you know. Can't, can't take any chances these days. You just gotta blend. Just keep blending, okay? Just blend. Your life be complete if you just blend. Just blend, come on, blend, let's blend together. Okay, I think that's enough. Um, and now, I'm gonna use, I'm gonna use something from my mirror palette, again. 
um, because I really like these colours, I really do. So I'm going to use the shades Charm and Refine, which are these two. These two, yeah. I use it a lot, I love this palette so much. Um, so I'm going to take Refine, which is this one. And I'm gonna just do it the same again because I like the colours blending in together, the brown and the nude, it's just it's nice, it's just great. Cause you see where I'm only going over my crease and then I'm I'm just staying at the corner of my eye. The more you do it, it's gonna come across naturally by itself. So you, they'll think, oh, how have you gotten that perfect finish and that such great fady kind of smoky bit? You didn't do anything. The makeup did it itself. It'll come out the way it was always supposed to come out. Okay, see, I just think that colour just adds so much when it adds so little. Um, so now I'm going back to the collection palette and I'm going to add some gold because gold is great. Um, I'm going to go back to the brush that I used at the beginning. Am I? No. I'm going to stick with the brush that I'm using. So I'm going to go with uh, golden brown. That's what it's called, golden brown. Take that across here on my lash line from the outer in. Gonna leave a little bit more. Um, like that. I like the shine it gives with this look. See that? You see? Do you see it? I think it looks great. Cool. Um, let me just actually check in the mirror. To make sure this is actually all going all right. Oh yeah, baby. Okay, now I'm gonna take the darker shade, the darkest shade um, on the collection palette <coughs> to finish off this look. I think, hopefully, if I don't change my mind. Um, I'm using Nutty now, which is this one at the very, very end. Um, so, literally, as little as I can, so I'm going to give it a couple dabs, and then I'm going to dab it on each side. See that? See it? Um, and then once the product product is on the corner of your eyes, where you want it to be, that's where you want to blend it out. So I'm then getting the product off the brush and then going back over my crease. Just to blend, blend, blend. Sorry, blocking the view. So that's all on. I'm literally just blending, um, blending it all out. And it's not looking too bad. But uh, so now I'm going to just add in a little bit of highlight, or just the, the very, very beginning shade that I used for my eyebrows, cherub. <laughs> um, tapped it on. Tapped it in the corners. How's that look? Yeah, lovely. Okay, 
Oh no, running out of battery. Okay, so I don't really like to wing my eyes. I don't I don't do that. Um I because I like the natural look, so I then I just uh, I take your eyelash colours and the mascara. Then I apply my mascara as you just do, everyone knows how to do that. And that is the finished look. So I'll apply the rest of my makeup now and then that'll be me ready to go. Um, so yeah, that was my first kind of makeup video. I think it went alright, I guess. Um, take a look in the doobly doo box below, you'll see my Instagram links and then I've got a bunch of pictures on there of makeup ideas that I've done if you'd like me to do a tutorial. Um, thank you for watching.